We go down to Austin. Mississippi State visits the Texas Longhorns. Texas, a 38-and-a-half point home favorite, total of 62-and-a-half. And I don't remember the kid's name, uh, but Blake Shapin is out. So we will we'll have to see exactly what the backup's name is. Uh, Van Buren or something, I believe it was. Here, we got it right here. Uh, Michael Van Buren Jr. There we go. And he's a freshman. He was 7 of 13 for 100 yards passing. No touchdowns, no interceptions last week. Blake Shapin was actually pretty good. Eight touchdowns, one interception uh, as, a, as a starting quarterback. And he was 68.5%. Had almost 1,000 yards already. And that's for a bad Mississippi State team. The stats have got Texas favored by 47.66. Uh, my power rating plus stats has Texas by 37. I think losing Shapin is way bigger than that. Um, it, it, the, the Mississippi State defense is putrid, putrid. And Texas has shown that they do not mind stepping on somebody's throat. It's the first SEC game at home for Texas. I, I think they're going to go out and kind of prove a point here. Number two in five factors plus talent to number 89. We we don't have to spend long on this. Let's let's go and wrap this thing up. Uh, I'll take Texas minus the thirty eight and a half. I don't necessarily like that number, especially that hook, uh, but that is the best number that you can get right now because I mean there's still thirty nines and whatnot if you feel like taking state, but I don't feel strongly about it uh, by any stretch of the imagination. The implied score at the sports books is forty nine to eleven and a half. I don't know if state gets to ten. I don't know. I, I don't think they get over ten. So I'm. Yeah, this is going to be rough. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and follow me on Twitter, at GaryWCE. If you want to toss in a question, you can email me, Gary, at winningcureseverything.com. Make sure and hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you next time.